guys. I go by the name of Illuminous Eyes, and I'm here to illuminate the motherfucking wise. Okay, guys. Today we got a really quick message, and this one's going to be for Aries. Aries, I found out the real pronunciation of your name is um pronounced Aris. Okay, so I think I might start calling you that. But nonetheless, if I get comfortable, I will. Okay. So um, I'm only going to pull one card and I'm going to use my intuition for one card and get messages from there. Um, I have a couple of other decks right here, but I'll only will pull one of those if I feel fit to. Okay. Let's get a card, please, for Aries, otherwise known as Aries. Okay. So we have the two of wands coming out in reverse. Okay. So this is your energy. So um, two of wands in reverse for me talks about obviously by book choices, but I feel like something that doesn't go the way you want it to go, Aries. Okay. I feel like you're going to start your week off, especially Monday and Tuesday, a little unhappy. Um, I feel like um, also you may, you may get the feeling to withdraw yourself from the internet or from the world. I feel like on between Monday and Tuesday, you're just going to feel the need to just spend time by yourself. OK, I feel like you don't really feel like being bothered or you don't feel like um, like doing a whole bunch of running around. I do feel like Monday and Tuesday is sinking, uh, is like um, significant for like being a little unhappy. OK, so I'm also getting something about Monday and Tuesday. There's like going to be an unexpected expense come up. OK, so I feel like I feel like you don't plan for something and it, it like because of it. I, I feel like you get yourself in a bind almost. I feel like you, you're going to spend money unexpectedly, possibly on a family member or your children. Okay. I'm also getting like someone's going to ask you to like go out their way to do an errand for them. It looks like your mother, grandmother, or like some type of elder, someone older. Okay. So I feel like you're going to do it though. You're going to do it out of love. You love them. You respect them. Okay. So I just feel like um, expect a lot of like unexpected events to happen um, for the first start of the week. Okay, Aries, that's what I got for you from the traditional deck. Um, who Who is Aries dealing with? Can I get a, a card? I use these cards. These are my um, evil eye deck. I didn't know why I picked these up, but my intuition told me to. What does the evil eye have to say to Aries, otherwise known as Eris? One card, please, for Eris. One card, please, for Eris. Okay, it says Scorpio, Pluto. So, yeah, I expect a lot of changes um, um, at the beginning of the week, okay? Um, but Scorpio, it says black, power, prosperity, open doors of mystery, prepare for the unknown. Yeah, prepare for the unknown. I, I prepare for a lot of unexpected expenses or prepare for things to change. There's a lot of changes going to happen this week or at the beginning of the week. I'm also getting like, there's a Scorpio. They may switch up on you. Okay. They may move out. I feel like a Scorpio is acting very mysterious or something's happening with the Scorpio. But, I, I, okay, so I'm also getting, like, if you were expecting bad news, Aries, with the Scorpio, I feel like someone here is doing black magic on them, but I feel like the black magic is to open doors, I feel like I feel like I feel like someone is is helping and is helping a Scorpio. This could be you, Aries. I feel like I'm also getting like you. I just heard you need to fight fire with fire. So I feel like you need to use some type of black magic to help a Scorpio. You need to step into the world of unknown because there's something in regards to their future that's happening that's so unexpected. And I feel like it will work for you because it's it's being done out of love. That's what I got for you, Aries, um, from that deck. One last card, please, from the sun card. Is there a sun card that you would like to say to Aries? One card, please, for Aries. You got to fight fire with fire. Can I get cards, please, for Aries? Yeah, tragedy, tragedy. You're going through a tragedy with a Scorpio. You may have Scorpio in your birth chart. I feel like, I feel like, I feel like some, you weren't, you didn't see something coming. It has something to do with your family member. That's a Scorpio. Yes, it says moving fast and can't help it. So something is something. It's there's a tragedy that's that's happening and it's 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 happening fast. It's going to happen fast. This may happen on Monday and Tuesday. I'm also getting if someone does choose to do, do something with black magic, it, it, it works fast 
or you need to move fast because I feel like I feel like you need to avoid a tragedy or something like that. That's what I got for you. Okay, Aries, I'm gonna leave it there. <laughs>